Well, now to Owensboro, where the verdict was returned tonight in the murder trial of Jacorian Johnson. Johnson, who is 18, is accused of shooting and killing 15-year-old Corbin Henry nearly two years ago. Eyewitness News' Desherian McBroom spoke with the mothers of the defendant and the victim about their emotions over the last two years. Jacoria Johnson was accused of shooting and killing 15-year-old Corbin Henry two years ago in Owensboro. After a few hours of deliberations, the jury found him not guilty of murder. He was found guilty of second-degree manslaughter, fourth-degree assault, and wanton endangerment. But Corbin's family is upset there wasn't more guilty charges. We are all really shocked. This is insult added to our injury. My son was worth much more than the maximum they could give him right now. Honestly, um, I'm really concerned about the murder charge that he did not get, mainly. Not much, but, you know, I'm, I'm not a fan of ever seeing him walk free again. Johnson was 17 when he shot and killed 15-year-old Corbin Henry. Johnson's mother says she feels for the mother of Corbin. I am sorry she lost her son. What's done is done, and I can't take it back, nor can she. But we both lost. And when I say we both lost, it's going to probably be a while before I get to touch my son and talk to my son like I choose to. At this time, Parm does say that she has a sense of relief. Hurting for the other family, but I'm relief. I have relief because I don't have hatred. I'm a mother. And... I hope she feels the same. Nancy says in the current state of violence, she hopes the court will use this case as an example. Gun violence is at an all-time high right now. And without them seeing a consequence to their actions, it will continue.